what's up guys and welcome back to another video right into my youtube channel today i'm gonna basically tell you how to fix every kind of starting not launching issue in titanfall 2 so stick to the end guys this will be a step-by-step -step tutorial in the end you'll probably know what to do in order to fix this kind of issue before we start right into the video i just want you guys to know let you guys know that, that i would really really appreciate it if you would just leave a like a comment or a subscription right into my youtube channel it will really make my day and help me out as a little youtuber as i am especially subscribing would be such a big support for me guys who would support my work and use you a little bit and i'm gonna really really be thankful for that and i'm gonna thank you for that so anyways i would just say let's get right started so the first step in order to fix this kind of issue is going to be to open up your task manager by using the shortcut or navigating down to your taskbar, right clicking it and opening up your task manager. Once this tab pops up, I want you to navigate to the top left corner of your screen, clicking onto processes, just ensure that you're sticking around it. And the next step is going to be to click one of those random processes. And afterwards, just type in T in order to find Titanfall. If nothing pops up, it's good for you. If something pops up, simply right click and tip and click onto end task. The next step is going to be to end the task manager. And what I want you to do next is going to be to take your shortcut of, of Titanfall or your Steam shortcut right on your desktop. And if you don't have it on your desktop, simply navigate to the bottom left corner of your screen. Click on the Windows symbol and use a Windows search function in order to find it. So once you found it, simply drag it right back on your desktop. Let's quickly come back, take the shortcut, right click it and navigate to the very bottom where it says properties. Next step is going to be to click on the compatibility and simply copy what I typed in or what I enabled. So let's quickly run through it, compatibility mode, enable run this program in compatibility mode 4, select Windows 8, disable the disable full screen optimizations as well as enable run this program as an administrator, hit apply and OK. I would personally recommend you to restart your PC afterwards and once it is restored it, you should be able to see this little administrator symbol right on your shortcut. What I want you to do next is going to be just some, simply double click it and start it and launch the game over the launcher. That's it for the video. I hope that I could actually help you out with this one. If it was like that, just leave a like, a comment or a subscription. I'm going to really be thankful for that and I'm really sorry if I couldn't help you, but I'm just going to do my best in order to help you out. Either way, I hope you guys have a wonderful day. See you at the next one and bye.